Well, I did want to talk about um, writing and film. And I remember, uh, what was it, a week or two ago, we were talking about The Matrix and how that progressed. And just from a writing standpoint, how do you go from the first movie, you know, we're finding out who the one is, what is the one, what The Matrix is. We end on such a high note, Neil, flying up into the air. How do we go from that to matrix four <laughs> and everything that was from a writing standpoint like what i don't what what happened you know what though i think the way matrix in the first one ended i feel like it it ended in a way that said the story was finished mm. but generally <laughs> you know if something is that massively big then it's like we gotta put out a second one right. you know and so now you have to a story that was meant to be finished now all of a sudden you have to come up with brand new material i think uh generally when you want something uh when you're writing a series you you have to kind of ink you usually stretch the story out yeah even more you stretch it out over a longer period of time and so if anything you could have probably taken matrix one mm -hmm. and stretched that out over oh, two or three movies. 100 percent. like had saying? had them not even go back in the matrix in the first movie as soon as he's pulled out everything that happens so is the second, outside then yeah. the second one you're going back in the third one he's realizing he's the one that kind of thing exactly so that first movie could have been stretched out all the way across three movies or whatever the plan was um the second one was cool yeah. in the sense of like it was an action flick mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying it's just like you're going back to the action kung fu route you know of like those I still masters have, thinking about the story of the second one now i have no idea what I don't, the point yeah. of it was <laughs> I, yeah it's it wasn't memorable in, in the least bit <laughs> You know, but I guess going deeper, discovering who you are as the one. Right. Um, and, and I guess that's what they were trying to play off of, you mm -hmm. know, is, is discovering who you are as the one and um, learning to bend spoons and, and the origin of who you are and that right. kind of thing and going deeper into that. Um, was it successful? Uh, yes. I liked the second one. The second <laughs> one was good. It was good as an action flick. Uh, but then on the third one, again, they had the intent. I think they had the intention um, with the second one of maybe going into a third because mm. it was so big. Right. right. And so as a result, um, they they kind of wrote a story that that extended into a third. But then I, I believe my own personal belief is that when you have something so strong, people don't like to see it end. Mm. You know, the whole feeling of be like, for the worse. Yeah. yeah. And so for like for the feeling of nostalgia, you're gonna see some of your favorite characters start dying, and or the you MCU. know <laughs> <laughs> oh, <who? Yeah>. MCU. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna start like killing off your favorite characters, and um, or I don't know, and and I think too with like Lord of the Rings, <laughs> not Lord of the Rings, but um, the uh, Game one, of Thrones. Mm. I thought the movie making on Game of Thrones was the the final season was very good. Oh, I found like as a, a lot spectacle, of, as something to watch. Yes, yeah, I. But I realized that it was gonna end. You know what I'm saying? I was like, okay, it's gonna end. Things are gonna move a little bit. Things did move really wonky. The 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 timelines and stuff. Right. How you know? Um, how emotions Jamie Lannister change was, like this? Like, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, and so like that should have been stretched out. That's mm. one thing I thought that like, if it was stretched out and um, Daenerys, for instance, had the opportunity to develop those feelings and right. resentment and eventually turn crazy. I think if she had time to do that, right. but you know, you realize it's been done for what, 10 years? I yes. think over a, a period of 10 years. And so people wanted to move on and stuff like that. So they had to just speed through it. But watching that, literally all those emotions and things just play out on her face in the span of five seconds. That was not. <laughs> I didn't. Uh, so, I didn't appreciate that. <laughs> I, I, I personally, this is me. I didn't think the story was bad. I think it was rushed. Yes. 